Hello, I am TVP, and um, this is my face reveal. Hi, um, I made the scrunchie. Okay, um, well, for anybody who doesn't know what I do, I am a 3D modeler, and um, even though I've taken quite a bit of a break. It was for six months. Um, and I can answer some questions that I gathered um, for the video from my Discord server. I'll probably put the link in the description. Um, but I, yeah, that's my intro. Um, pretty much this channel is for process documentation. Um, oh, there's a little. Um, so I don't really take a lot of time. Oh, I just realized something. I didn't set this up beforehand. Um, oh gosh. Well, there we go. Um, you want to just scoot me over? Yeah. All right. That's how this is going to work. <laughs> cool. Um, so, right. Uh, I do, what's going on here? Okay, that's fine. I do like to m listen to music. Um, so, <laughs> this file has everything that I've worked on this year so far. Like, purely 2022. Uh, whether it's been released or not. Just go ahead and start hiding things. Um, yeah, this one was a commission. The bottle and the chains. This hair is a uh, Christmas present. I will be finishing. Oof. The hoodie was a, a commission too, but they gave me permission to put it on the market. Uh, given I changed the UV map and the textures, so. Uh, the tail and the, the skunk stuff, the skunk ears, they're cute. Those are actually in my Gunroad store. And then this turtle is in my server. <laughs> this like, and then this is in my Gunroad store too. But what I'm doing today just like put you like uh oh put you back there yeah for inspiration so this um now that I'm back I'm going directly to uh prizes giveaway entry winners and course like um, commissions and friends work work for friends and stuff like that um, but I will be making I will be making a free asset after I make this but um so scuffed won the art contest with this beautiful crow and um, what I'm gonna do is my best crack at uh, crow in flight so that they can use this crow as a spring joint. Don't you think that would be cute? But let's see. Uh, I can just go for it and eyeball it and work 
from there. That's a good one. But I'm not going to use any one crow. You can see in the imagination. Whoopsies. And, um, yep. Okay, that, that, that. Right up. So, let's just jump into it. Uh, add a cube. Add a cute little cube. Alright. So, um, what's going on? I have not looked at any of this stuff in forever. Get back in there later. Aha! A material. Uh, uh, what? No. No. I don't know. Well. Um. Also, crow for scuffed. Let's go back up here. I have, I am, I don't know what I'm doing. Where am I? Crow. Okay. I don't understand. Uh, oh, also, down here, um, over here, you can see there are, uh, what I do, every, every keystroke, it's, uh, it's there, so you can see that. And add modifier, cool clipping. Whoops, I want to see the crow. Um, uh, I was trying to find um, the materials. Uh, there we go. Crow. Whoops, crow for scuffed. Through there, Let's just make the material. Yep. Okay, and I want it all to match. What's my watch saying to me? It's telling me to get up again. Okay, wait a minute. Uh, so, yeah, I was in the particles tab. All right, fair. Look, it's been a long time, so, okay. Crow. Uh... And extrude that. Oh, you know what? Uh, I. Well, I guess I did delete it. Okay, cool. There we go. I'm done. No, no way. It's got to look pretty. I gotta hand draw those feathers. I don't know. Okay. Is it top down? I 
I like that. Okay. Come back. Uh. Whoa, stop. I wish I could skip. Um. Yeah, there we go. Um, all right. Now that I'm kind of remembering what to do and everything set up, let's look at the questions. My untitled form. Uh, okay, I'll just go top to bottom. Let's see, let's see. Yep. Uh, so what's your favorite thing when it comes to making... Oh! It switched them around. Uh, anyway, uh, what's your favorite thing when it comes to making assets? Uh, my favorite thing... Actually, yeah. So, I... And with any material, with any, like, um, art form, uh, what I enjoy about making things, just anything in general, um, is, is getting to see something that's really simple, like the building blocks of, of stuff, um, you know, like simple shapes, and then going from that to like a final item, like the transformation of the materials is so complete that you would, you know, like it's not identifiable as it, the original, um, like tool, like. If you saw like this, like this hair, these ears or something, for instance, like they were cubes. I made them all from cubes, but when I press tab, you can see that they, you know, they're like pure quads. All my, all my assets are uh, I would say like maybe two, three different instances where there, where I had to use like tries or something when I was first starting out. But everything recently, um, everything twenty, everything mid twenty twenty one and on is is fully quads because I like my mesh to be. Uh, to be easy to work with and to make sense and like if people even want to use it as a base mesh and like edit it completely then it shouldn't be too hard for them to be like oh I you know I like this hair I'm gonna put it over here and put it all over her head and give her a bowl cut um yeah so my favorite thing about making assets is that I can make something out of nothing to put uh, to put along to make a long story short um, okay another question what's a skill either 2d or 3d that you really want to learn a skill 2d or 3d well, there's a lot that I have done. Like, my interest in sculpture and, my, like, the skills that I have um, for asset making. Uh, what am I doing? Um, how do I select loops? 
Uh. Hold down shift. Hold down control. Hold down alt. Alt. Yeah, alt click. Okay. Um so getting getting to make assets started with like uh um doing um ceramics and i guess something that i would like to learn is like maybe glass blowing or metalworking like just go in that same vein of like firework and uh, sculpture and um, I don't know I think it I think that glass would be really cool to work with I had a friend who really loved it so I don't know um, yeah I do glass mm. Let's look. The height of a rocket after it is launched is height T equals next. Uh, will you be finishing any assets you were supposed to make before the hiatus? Like the ones people want to give away? What the hell? Whoops. Um, yeah. That's the first thing that I'm doing now that I'm back to work um, case case in point um, yeah the stuff that I make like I um, for other people for like giveaways for my server for promotion all of that's going to be like the priority uh, to get finished before I start any new big projects uh, I definitely and like especially because like I'm gonna try to do daily hour videos where I like sit down and in order to get back to work and get back into well like not only the workflow for assets but the workflow for um, YouTube because I you know I, I like that it's more than just a process blog because I have been um, you know, making music to go with the the time lapse videos, but I, uh, you know, I'll be doing all those side projects and stuff, or not side projects, but like just progressing the project as a whole. Um, after I get some some unfinished business finished. It's got to look more cool. Look. Okay, so. <sighs> They're like an S-curve. Their like little backs are hunched. Um... Yeah, and that being said, this crow is not going to get, um, it's not going to get released, but if people want me to do birds, I can as well. I'm going to try and make something at the end to post in my Gumroad shop just to, like, get it going. I'm going to start off with, like, free assets because... I don't know that's how I started that that's when it was like more fun um not that it wasn't fun right before I took my break I just it had become a job I mean like that's what you want is to like make your hobby a job um but I think that uh obviously like I had a reaction to that but it's like when I went to college I um just kept thinking like you know just keep going just keep um oh we're sponsored by Activate Windows <laughs> um 
But yeah, even when I felt like quitting, I just kept doing it. And like, that's kind of like what you have to do in work, in school. Um, when you have like responsibilities and stuff, and just like, that's the difference between like doing it and not doing it is showing up for it, doing it. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, yeah, so I'm gonna do the rest of those. Uh, oh, thank you. I got a welcome back. Um, tentacle themed assets sounds super fun. I like the fun, um, Definitely like the fun suggestions. Um, rotate that by the x axis. No, by the y axis. No, by the z axis. No. Rotate it by. What? What are you? What happened? Why are you like this? Um, rip. Nope. Yep. Oh, gosh. What am I doing? Uh, I'm just gonna... Yeah. And then... Whoops! Well, actually... I like it. Like, how can I make this into quads? Like this! Ha 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 ha! Oh, that would make a weird face. Okay! Uh, smooth. Smooth. Nope. Smooth. Sweet. Uh, smooth vertices. Not that smooth. But smooth. Uh, rotate by, oh gosh. I kind of miss when I was like first, first making assets or like even exploring Blender and poly modeling and stuff. Because, like, just seeing the polygons, it was so intimidating at first. I mean, like, some people's modelings did not help. But, like, also you can't, like, blame all, like, the... All the, all the meshes on VRChat creators. I guess I can say it like that. Uh, so there's quite a bit of um, borrowing from other platforms and so um, yeah not everybody who produces something is responsible for the creation of that thing okay another another one uh, tentacles. Even if one gains purpose, is life really worth it? Anyway. <laughs> okay. It's an interesting, um, turn. 
Uh, I'll, I'll, it's a multiple parter, so I'll like uh, answer that. If we, if one gains purpose, is life really worth it? Um, so I think it's up to the individual to decide if they're into what they're doing or not, and if they don't like the purpose they've found, then um, maybe pivot the business. I guess, so to say. Um, oh. I'm distracted by this song. I really like this song, Snake Eyes, by Rob Star. I have a song with him. Go listen to that, and then go listen to Rob Star's channel. Um, <clears throat> is it worth it? Um, so yeah, I guess speaking on that, like I've spent a lot of time in my life unhappy or feeling like it was just a struggle for struggle's sake, and like. Going back to the college, for example, um, like my purpose was to graduate at that time. And then, like at the end, you know, there's no more college. Like you've done it, you've done the degree and everything. So I think that you, you have a lot of struggles. You like always be struggling and that's kind of what life is about and if you're into that then you'll really enjoy life and knowing that like each struggle is not about like getting to a goal it's about like going through the process um this person uh, anyway, would you be able to make a barbed wire set or make some wings? I don't know. I was just thinking and thought it might be cool for you to try out. Yeah, definitely. Barbed wire sounds like kind of gnarly. And, uh, I mean, I can't even think of how... I, I like read the questions before and I was like thinking about that one. I'm not sure how uh, I would model it, design it and stuff. <laughs> because um, when I was thinking about it, I was like, oh no, like what would it even sit on? Like, directly against the skin? That sounds like... terrible. So... So then I was thinking, how would I design it in a way that I would, like, actually wear it? I don't know. And barbed wire as an accessory that's like intense y'all what are you out here doing oh he's just got like a thick like a like a barrel chest he's like thick um let's see so uh yeah yeah no not that one is it that one? It is that one. Uh, yeah, yeah. More rock star. Um, yeah. Um, I think that's the end of the questions I like want to get into um, live streaming again yeah whoops Yeah. <laughs> 
it's not a low poly. <gasps> okay, that's fine. That's actually good. I accidentally saved. Ah. Bruh. Woo. Sweet. Oh gosh. Okay. Uh la 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 la. So. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh clipping, no clipping. Bro, yeah, brother. Okay, really? What did I do? Oh, uh, so wait, hold on. We don't like that. Stop. Um, right. A uh, question. Um, what are my favorite tools and add-ons to use in Blender? Um, I definitely like, uh, so if I press N, I've got this shortcut, or, uh, yeah, to the shortcut visualizer thing so it shows off Ooh. it shows off the keystrokes that I'm using so I can like describe what I'm doing you know it keeps me honest if I say like oh I'm pressing uh, uh, alt V and it's actually G then it shows it and I'm you know tongue-tied but Still, you can see what it really is. Um, Simply Orange is not a sponsor. Um, I like, yeah, I like that. Uh, other than that, I do just kind of like the, uh, what we're given, you know, default blender kind of, um, add-ons tools I use grab Woo um whoops so yeah I'm um I'm pretty pretty uh easy I'm easy to please So, tools and add-ons. Uh, I do like having my um, I do like having my blender um, cool colors. <laughs> oh, so uh, but that's just in preferences. You can um. Oh my gosh, what am I doing? Okay. One, two, three, four, face. One, two, three, four, face. One, two, three, four, face. All right, and the reason I did that was because I wanted to fix this edge loop. See, now it's not all crazy. 
weird, wonky. It's sensible and not wonky. And I can do that. I guess I'll do that and that. You know, I, I have definitely gotten rusty. It's not a super low poly model, but um, we're just gonna smooth those vertices. Okay, I'm enjoying this a lot. So, still listening. All right, you can go back to the pits. Actually, no. Here, bro. Sweet. I like to get in my feels. I've been watching um, Love Island Australia lately. Fun. Well, okay. Give me... Right. How would I make fishnets? Um, I would say I can find a video of making fishnets from Antara, maybe. Uh, Antara knows the blender add-ons and stuff like that to use. So I can actually what I'm going to do, because I'm not making fishnets now, but I might do a tutorial on them, but I can also just put Antara's server in the description and um, yeah, it'll be good because that's uh, this one smart cookie a person's been doing Blender for or doing 3D modeling for a long, long time Also, shade smooth, sweet. Um, it's looking actually. I should just like embrace the low poliness of it. Oh, I see why it's silly. There. That looks like a foot. Okay. It's <laughs> pretty silly. Plus, whoops. What am I doing? Uh, and then give me that, and then give me that. All right, cool. <sighs> Small. 
Yes. Whoa. Small. Not that much. Um. Cute. Super cute. Uh. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Okay. Okay. Um. Um, right. Well, that's the end of the question section. <laughs> so I'm just uh, chugging along here. Base color, how about just make it glossy black? Bruh. I don't know, it's cute. It's, yeah, it's cute. Okay. Going to no, really? Oh, good. Okay, so. A brand new face tap. Ahem. <gasps> no. What my sweet bass boy? Um, cool. Da 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 da. Kind of all I, I need, right? Okay. Uh, and modifier. Uh, apply. 
reply. Uh, <clears throat> yeah? Can I get it later? Can you put it on? Mm. Yeah? Bridge? Yeah? Thank you. That was my mom. Bird. Also, that's a big. <laughs> Whoops. Whoa. Anyway, it can it can stay up there. That's fine. Um, <clears throat> control and delete everything. Uh, let's see. Save. <clears throat> it's not my bun's hairs. Scroll. Where? Scroll. Okay. Ah, gosh. What export? <clears throat> I did not export. Whoops. Ugh, my watch just won't let me. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, I like that because it's like very swooshy. What's going on? What's the heck? Okay. Anyway. Okay, cool. Figured it out. Um, fake them. Fake. Fake that. We and now we wait while it bakes. That smells good.
is finished. That's just a carbon fiber bird. Yep. Perfect. Uh, maybe brush? Oops, brush? For feather? Fur animals? That's not really what I want. What if I say feather? Whoops. I don't know. We get a leather bird. I don't know. Okay. Wait. Hey. Oh, it's all the stuff. Oh. I know why. All tied. Yeah. I always have to do this. So once I find the error, I just name it version one point whatever. No, nope. gotta do all that again. It's okay. Discard you. Wasn't doing anything that crazy anyway. <clears throat> Man, I really need to get better practice. To be a rivet, it's a rivet. Um. I'm gonna make its beak gold. And let me have, where do I mask? No, is this? Yeah. The polygons, can you? Uh, oh, now I have to click, ah, I have to click you. Ah, oh, there's so much I have to learn. I was like, not even, hadn't even hardly learned any substance painter yet. Ouch. Okay. Okay. Um <clears throat> maybe not. What um there we go. Better. <laughs>
There we go. Um, <clears throat> now another material. Uh, charcoal. Yeah, you can be a lumpy bird. This is another good jam. Okay. Broke the vault. By so cliche. Huh. Should be a, a denim bird. Hey. Excuse me. I'm sorry. How's that? Um. No more anymore anymore. Okay, open the folder. Yo. Meow. That's that's how we're gonna do it. It's all right. Oh. Okay, and then we go into rendering mode.
No. Oh gosh. Okay. Okay. Render that. Wait. Oh no. I wanted it to be bigger. Okay. And then minimum samples would be 100. And then we go for it. <sighs> OK.
Okay. My watch told me to stand up, so I'm going to go ahead and end it, especially since the rendering is silly. It's silly! Um, thank you for joining me on my Blender adventures and for attending my uh, face reveal. Um, it looks like I'm a little bit rendery. Okay. Um, and with that, I am going to end the video. Bye!